Welcome back and let's talk about CoinHive website miner. So CoinHive is a really special little miner that can be implemented inside of a website. And the website that has this CoinHive miner implemented can mine coins with your PC without your knowledge. And the most popular coin that websites mine with miners like CoinHive is Monero. And that is because Monero is the most anonymous one and you cannot track to which address that uh, coins went or anything like that. There are many other miners like CoinHive but CoinHive is by far the most popular one. And I got idea for this video by this article here. They actually tested 175 million websites for this kind of of miners and as you can see if you scroll down a little bit here that CoinHive had 93% of the activity on those websites and from 175 million websites 23,872 of them had some kind of script miner running and all of the other ones are 6% uh, combined so they actually do not even compare to something like CoinHive. But you do not have to worry that a lot of the websites from those 23,000 are the ones that you probably visit because 91% of them have less than 50 monthly visitors. So that is like what? One or two visitors per day. So they are mostly like test websites or something that somebody made for themselves to just see how these uh, things can work. And 0.27% uh, of websites have more than 50,000 views per month. And so some of them might be the ones that you probably visited, but not something that you do like every day or every week. So the most popular one is Torrents 2. It has 3.5 million monthly visitors. And the second one is whatsmyipaddress.com. So that is the website that I actually visited uh, here and there when I just wanted to know my website and I was too lazy to go to go into the command prompt. And some of the other ones are, well, I didn't actually hear about any of them except free bit co and that is the website where you can get little parts of bitcoin just like hundred or thousand satoshis per hour by clicking on the commercials and now you can see that they don't actually pay you anything from their own pocket you actually pay them by watching commercials and by mining with your pc so those miners are actually really awesome because if you, for example, have like a 4-core CPU, they will be mining with only like 1-core, but if you have 8-core CPU, they will be mining with 2-cores. So you probably won't even notice them that they are mining on your PC if you don't have Task Manager open or some other program to monitor your CPU activity. But all of that is not as bad as it sounds because you can really easily fight against this kind of miners. I personally use this uBlock Origin it is an add-on for Google Chrome. It can be used for some other browsers like Mozilla, Internet Explorer, or probably some other ones. But it works really, really good. I actually never uh, seen some kind of a minor mining when I had uBlock Origin installed. But once before it happened, when I didn't have uBlock Origin installed, it was when I visited the Pirate Bay and I noticed my CPU going to like 25 or 50%, I don't remember, and I was like, why is, why is this happening? And then I seen that Chrome is actually using all of that CPU power. So I just thought it is some memory leak or something like that. But no, it was actually a CoinHive miner and they made maybe like cent two from me mining for them. So if you ever experience something like that, just download uBlock Origin. But you have to know that uBlock Origin also blocks other commercials. So if you are using uh, YouTube, which you are right now, it will actually block commercials on all of the videos. But if you want to support some uh, um, some uh, creators, you can just click uh, this button here. So it will disable the uBlock origin on that website. So if you don't want to block commercials on YouTube, you can just click it like that. And when you visit other websites, it will be active, but it won't be active on YouTube. So if you ever visited one of those sites, you can do it just like and uh, like a test I have this program like right here it is called rain meter and you can see my CPU usage so this website is not mining with my CPU so you can see that it's between like 5 and 10 percent but if we go to something like what's my IP address.com we'll just do it as a test if my CPU usage will go up 
okay let's let's allow them to know my location and my CPU usage is still like 5% and now we are going to disable my uBlock origin and reload the website and let's see what happens with my CPU usage you can see that my CPU usage is now a little bit higher by percent or two but this website is still not mining with my CPU and I don't know why that is happening so some of those websites don't actually start mining when you visit the main domain they actually start mining only when you visit some kind of subdomain so if, if I would click like here or here or something like that if I would just uh, try to research something on the website it might start mining then and they actually do that so we don't even notice that they are mining because of course I expected that website will start mining the moment I visit what's my IP address.com but they are getting smarter and smarter every day and they start mining only when you click on some links that have those miners enabled so thank you guys for watching this video let me know if you ever experienced some website trying to mine with your cpu and what that website was see you again in another video and bye